So today I'm talking about a Kia with the P0447 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. So what is a Kia P0447 code? Well, it's an evaporative emissions control system vent control circuit open. And what does this mean? Well, modern cars have an EVAP system that helps contain all the gas vapors inside of the gas tank and they get sent back into the engine and get burnt off so they don't escape into the atmosphere. And the onboard computer seen an issue with this, so have to be troubleshooting to know why. And the most common cause of a P0447 code is going to be the vent valve, possibly the charcoal canister, the vent valve wiring, and possibly a blowing fuse. And while there can be some other causes of this, usually if you get these other things, you're going to get other codes. So if you are getting other codes, it might possibly be one of these other things. But if you're just getting a P0447 code, then very likely, then these are the most common problems with that. And so the first thing to do when you get this code is to go locate the vent valve on your particular Kia. And there can be some differences. And the vent valve is going to be located by the charcoal canister somewhere, which is located up and underneath the vehicle by the gas tank. And sometimes it could be a part of the charcoal canister. And then sometimes it'll be separate, but it'll be real close to it, so even if it is separate. So for example, here is the vent valve right here on this particular Kia and the charcoal canister is down farther. And then on this Kia, this is a 2005 Kia Sedona, it's part of the charcoal canister. You have to remove the charcoal canister and you look in the back and it's right there. So the vent valve can be separate from the charcoal canister or it can be a part of the package. But the first thing to do is locate where this vent valve is on your particular Kia. And once you do locate it, the next thing is just check out this wiring. Be sure it's plugged in good. Be sure there's no opens or shorts or anything like that because any open short or any problem like that is going to cause problems. So you're going to want to make sure that's good and also keep in mind that this can also be on a fuse so you want to check for any blowing fuses especially if you're not getting no power to the vent valve and there's some different ways you go about testing it if you wanted to if you have a good obd2 scan tool quite often there's an option inside of there that will enable it so you can turn it on and off and you can listen to it and it'll make a little click sound if you're close to it and usually that indicates that it's working and that the circuit's all working there's also some other methods you go about testing the vent valve if you wanted to there's a lot of youtube videos on that the vent valve is a low cost part so if it, so many people when they suspect it's bad they just go ahead and replace it so if you do check out the wiring and the wiring all looks good there's no open shorts or anything like that and this harness is all plugged in good there's nothing like that then the vent valve probably did fail at that point and you can either test it or replace it and like i said most people would just go ahead and replace it i'll jump over on amazon just to give you an idea how much they're costing right now they're ranging around 55 27 49 23 14 dollars so like i said they're not not hugely expensive parts or anything but if you have checked out all the wiring and that's all good there's no blown fuses there's nothing like that then very likely at that point there's something wrong with this vent valve and it simply needs to be replaced and so that's basically it i just want to give a real quick brief overview of how you go about fixing a kia with the p0447 code if you have anything to add please comment down below if you have any questions ask me and i'll try to answer them if this video helps you please click like please click subscribe and have a good day